Hello and welcome back to Boo Polo Channel. My name is Pascal. Today I am going to do a review of a very, very budget uh, multimeter by Astro AI. It's the AM33D. Uh, it's not auto ranging, it's the most basic one you have, but we are going to test it out. If you want to keep, leave one in your car or one in your, uh, m m maybe in, in two or three different places, or you want to give one just for a homeowner, this is fine. If you want to use one just for testing batteries or something, or testing the electricity, but it will also do resistance. So in length, it's five and one quarter or 134 millimeters. Uh, it's got a rubber sleeve on it. I'm going to leave the rubber sleeve on it, which is handy to have. It's a funny shape, so we will give it on its widest point, uh, three and one sixteen, no, three and one eight, we will say. And in the thickness, in the thickest point uh, would be down here, would be one and three eighths or 30, five millimeters. Uh, so it weighs just six ounces, 6.04 to be exact, or in metric, that will be 171 grams. It's got a nine volt battery in the back of it. It takes a couple of seconds only to open it. Not like some of the bigger ones, you might have to take off the back cover. And there's a little notch for your nail and the cover and the nine volt battery goes in there it comes with that it's heavy duty battery it only takes seconds to replace not like some of them it's got a little stand here it says for the fuses inside it look on your manual so you'll have to look in that in your manual there's two fuses inside it i'm sure with the stand it's up like this so what features has it got it's uh, it's in the off position so i will put it into normal uh, for in the US, you will put it on 200 volts. I will put the light on. You, if you want to do your uh, voltage check of your normal AC in in the common is on the right, not in the middle. Be careful with that. And then we will put this one here. You will have two on, under 200 volts for AC. You see the little snake. You see the little snake. That means AC. Uh, a little snake, V V and the snake. So 200 will be for uh, 120 volts in the US. Uh, if you are uh, using a higher voltage, like 220 or 240, up to 240, you will put it on the 600, right? Now, if you're doing your amps, uh, we will be going, the next one down is your amps, and, and that's micro amps, um, milliamps, and amps. Now, if you're going into normal amps, you would put the lead, lead back, this lead back over here, okay? You can, there's a hold button on it as well. But normally, you will have it in the two on the right, okay? So, that's the amps. They have square wave output. So, continuity. You see where it has continuity? So, It's a little bit slower than the more expensive ones, but it works. It beeps and it's giving you the continuity there, zero, 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 right? You can also test a diode with this. There is no setting for testing your capacitors, but at this price range, we wouldn't expect it. Now, if you are doing, uh, if you want to check your resistance, these are all resistors, okay? Okay, that's not, it's not a problem, but, if you, but, but you need to know what your resistor is. I know these are 470K. I'll move them in here so you can see them. I know they're 470. So I have to put this one over where it says uh, 200K. So that's 200K. And so I'll have to put it on the one next to that, which will be uh, 20 milli. So uh, we will, we will try and get this done here, and that should come in, yes, 0 0.47 milli. Yeah, 0.47. Because it's only 2,000 counts, we're not going to get a number after 47. So it's 0.47 um, milli ohm, which is 470K. And so we'll set that aside there for a minute. Uh, we're going to again, and then when you are going to, th this next one is really for batteries. So these are bolts DC, right? So you want to check your 
battery up to 600, 200. You need to, for a 9 volt battery, you're going to be on 20 here. And uh, for, uh, these, are, these are millivolts, like 2000 millivolts, 200 millivolts, but this is 20 volts. So 20 volts is going to be for your uh, batteries from AA and 9 volt batteries and everything like that. So the, it, it's, it, it's a very, very much budget, but like it's, uh, you could have a couple of these. You could give them to your friend. You can, if, you can have it in your car. You could uh, you just leave it in your car all the time and for emergencies, and it's going to do all the basic stuff you want to. Now, if you're going to be doing electronics, you're going to be buying something like this that costs um, five times the price, and this one that costs three times the price. And the other ones, this is the, uh, or you could have your fluke, and your fluke is going to cost, that this little budget fluke is costing, this budget fluke is 10 times the price of this. So, so yes, uh, this is very, very handy. I bought this myself. I, it was not sent out to me by Astra AI like, like some, but this is not. This was uh, bought on our, ourselves. And uh, so, uh, yeah, it's, it does everything it says it does. For It's a 2,000 count, and that's all you really need for testing your, your electricity. It will tell you if it's reverse current with a minus on it, and then that's all you need to do for checking your outlets in your house, or if, uh, and you want to test the amp of a motor. It does all of the above. So, that's my review. I bought this on Amazon. I'll give you a link below. Uh, in the description where you can buy it uh, and you can check the latest price there and thank you very much for watching and if you like this video or any of our other videos uh, please subscribe